Hello guys, Phoenix here, and welcome back to some Civilization 6, where we are indeed recording this time. Uh, so that's good. It's a good start. Let's get into it. Uh, I was wondering if you guys would be interested in seeing some, uh, some of the original Civilization game. With, uh, Civilization 6 marking the 25th anniversary of the series. Just thought it might be an interesting idea to go back to where it all began. But who knows, who knows. Um, anyway, we must find a good campus spot. Here might be a good idea. Because... Yet these two adjacency bonuses, and then you get the adjacency bonus from the previous campus. And then I guess we could have another one here, here, and here, maybe? Or just another one here, maybe get the two bonuses. Uh, that's actually not a bad idea. Do we want to build a, a camp? Uh, do we want to build that, or do we want a carnival? Um, let's say we build a carnival, actually. Here? Yes? Maybe that's bad, I'm not sure yet. Um, okay. Well, let's uh, keep going. So this guy was just doing a little bit of exploring for me. Okay. Uh, in case you guys haven't realized, I am down to uploading just one video a day now. We're not going to do the half a billion I've been doing before. Because, uh, yeah, interest seems to drop really, really fast if you spam out videos. Um, so what were we doing? We were taking these guys. Ah, yes, you can come down here. These guys were heading in this direction in hopes of getting the upgrades. Um, I think I kind of want you over between these two. No, I would probably want this guy over here. This guy here, so yeah, they can all move in together. Actually, just here would do, wouldn't it? No, it'd need to be here. Because needs to be adjacent. If I put him here, he's only going to be adjacent to this guy if they're on these two tiles. So he needs to be right here. Okay then, um, it's going to require a little bit of a shuffle. But that is okay. So we're currently getting machinery for the crossbows, which uh, is why we're moving these archers all over here. This guy actually, on, on second thought, should stay right here so that he can get his upgrade. There's no particular reason for us to move him all the way out. Okay, well you can sit there. Uh, there's probably no reason to move you either, was there? Okay, yep, fair enough. We'll move this guy back in there as well. And then they can set up here and here, and these other two can go up that way. Well, you're not moving any further, but we'll have these guys. Oh, yeah, of course, they can literally stand on each other, can't they? Oh, wow. I'm intelligent. Don't worry, don't worry. It's a support unit, of course. It can. St uh, Phoenix is unintelligent. But we all already knew this. Um, this guy can probably move in over here. Can probably surround the city, to be honest. Uh, yep, yeah, yeah, doesn't help us. Okay, uh, you were going to turn this into a. Plantation, and there goes our worker. Let's have a look. What are we working right now? Anything I disagree with. This is a really, really bad tile, isn't it? It is indeed. So we're producing, I assume we're producing our uh, carnival 
street over there. In which case, maybe this will end up becoming something as well. Production district, maybe? Because that is technically a hills, isn't it? And that's stone. I'm not sure what the adjacency is for the, uh... Uh, what's it called? Oh, we don't even have it yet. Yeah, I know what I mean. I know what I mean. Oh, that's being pillaged. Um, is that really that bad? What do we lose? Probably one food? Yeah. Maybe I will send a, a builder out there to repair that. Scout over there. I should probably just automate this guy. Uh, where do I want him? I want him, like, over this way. Okay, he can just do everything turn by turn. I want this guy... Can we not move in there? Never mind. Okay, well, oh god, let's move up here. So have you just move over here. We'll get some exploration done by this guy. Okay. Uh, interesting fact, in Civilization 1, you could move these guys out into the ocean, and if they were there when they ran out of movement points, they sunk. Which makes so much sense. Uh, if you think about it historically, you could take gullies into the ocean, and try rooms as well, uh, but they definitely couldn't stay in the ocean. Oh, there's a bee buzzing around my room. There is there is a bee on my cheek. Okay, cool. Well, um... Be appreciated if you buzzed off. Eh? Eh? Was that really bad? It's, it's still there. Oh, there it goes. One second, I've got my phone right here. Let's see if I can grab a photo of it. Oh, it's not on my cheek anymore, but... Wait, stay still. No! It's literally flying at my camera. Bugger off. No! Stay a decent distance away so I can take a photo of you. <sighs> Come here. Okay. Oh, I have my flash on. Alright, well, a photo of that bee will now be included in the video. Enjoy. It really doesn't want to go away. It's a really big bee as well. I don't think it's a wasp. Maybe it won't sting me just for the fun of it. Alright, give me a sec. I think I gotta get this thing out of my room. It's gonna buzz around for the rest of the recording. Give me a second. Buzz off. This is a really bad place for you to be. Get it? B? Huh? Because you're a B? Ugh. Oh. oh, God. Even when I'm not recording, I'm making terrible puns. I'm still recording. Maybe this will be included. Alright, guys. B crisis averted. There are no more bees in my room. And ideally, it will stay like that way. Ah, stay that way for a while. We have got the, the nets back across my windows. I don't know why they weren't there in the first place. I must have knocked them when I opened the window. Either way, um, okay, so these guys were just gonna, gonna hang out in here until we got crossbows. Yeah? Are we going to form an escort? Cool. I feel like we formed the escort the wrong way there. Let's have, it doesn't seem to matter. Okay then, that's fine. So, you can go this way. I think you shall go up onto this one. Alternately, we could buy this tile just to save myself some time. I don't think so. So we'll move you down here. You can then take up residence in that spot. But we will take you out. Uh, what were you doing? Absolutely nothing. Just fortify. Claim a great person. We get a great scientist. Yay. Look at us and all of our, our science points. Let's recruit the great scientist. Um, okay, now what can you do with this guy? Uh, gain 100 faith. Uh, uh, this holy site. Huh? 
So I guess it's different each time. So this guy gives a science adjacency adjacency bonus. So it now gets three science and three faith. Oh, that's pretty cool, actually. Oh, that's really cool. Okay. I see what it means now. Oops. Um, let's keep going. Thanks for keeping the peace on the continent. Bully for you! Glad I could help, um, I guess. I don't even think I'm on the same continent as you. Indeed, I'm not. You're on. I'm on the wrong thing. This one. You are in... Avalonia. I am... Also in Avalonia. Okay. That's the continent of Uru. And that's Avalonia. I guess we're on the same continent, in which case declaring a war would upset him. Well, I don't know. Do I even care? He doesn't seem to like me. Why do you not like me? I don't think I care if he likes me. Ah. Okay, then. It's alright. I don't like him either. Hmm. <laughs> Now, harbour. Trade route capacity. Encampment. Hanging gardens? I'm really just surprised nobody has built it yet. Yet, yet again, I could clear that with something, but it yeah, seems like work. Seems like too much work. I was probably also going to put something there, weren't I? For adjacency bonuses? Maybe. It was probably the case. Oh, well, too late now. It's going to be the Hanging Gardens. What do I want you to build? You built your granary, I assume. A yeah, monument. And you are just going to sit here. And next turn, you are going to gain massive ultra bonuses. You're going to go down here. Uh, this guy, you can just fortify. And you're going to sit up here. Awesome, they all made it in time. Unit needs orders, uh, don't do anything. And you have already done that, so I guess I shall now just move you. I oh, will do the rice next, actually. Yeah, especially because this one's on a river. Okay, um, why are you insisting on doing something? That's really weird. Um. Okay, so we have got stirrups from what? Feudalism. I'd imagine I the whole say. world is one big machine. Machine in democracy. It was feudalism. It's your vote that counts. In feudalism, it's your count that votes. <laughs> um. Do we want this? Newly trained builders gain two extra actions. What do we got right now? Trade routes and production in all cities. Might not actually be that bad. Oh, we can always change it later. Trigger a Eureka for military engineering. We didn't get anything, did we? Ah, who knows. Well, we're trying to trigger all the Eurekas anyway, so what do we got? Mathematics gives us Petra. Shipbuilding. Printing. Own two universities. Maybe not. I guess we'll do the one that we can get. Do we have anywhere we can build a pasture? If we don't, maybe we'll just go for horseback riding. 
No, it doesn't look like it, does it? Okay, we'll just grab horseback riding. It's four turns. Ah, how much do these cost? 200 gold. Gosh, oh, screw that. Okay, well, that's not going to happen. We are not paying enough to upgrade all of these guys to crossbowmen. We may start just producing them. Um, do we just capture this? I feel like we just take it. No, 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 we'll wait for it to come out, then we'll capture it. Oh, they might escort it. Who knows? Who knows? What do we want? Theology? We're going to get two campus districts. Yep. Okay, then. We'll do this one. You can fortify until next turn. Ah, uh, yes, you're going to get the rice. Now, you. Warmongering penalty. What? So, Cassus Belli represents reasons to go to war with a warmonger a penalty for a declaration of war or capturing cities are reduced or eliminated. Okay, now out of interest, does that give us anything else? Okay, well, we're going to have to work out what we can do to get rid of that penalty entirely. Maybe we'll just have to take a moderate warmonger a penalty. I don't mind. Oh, is it? Oh, gods. Sex, come on. Come on, what a... She's not very nice. We will not ab abide sacrilege. Oh. They don't like my religion. Look, no one likes us. Let's just get the warmonger a penalty. I don't think I care. We'll arrange our units and go to war. Ah, yes. Make my rice better. Better than all the other rice. Can you attack over there? Who knows? Maybe I, I just shouldn't risk it and I should move them over. Yeah, I think that's what I'll do. We'll just... We won't bother risking it. We'll just have them all within two tiles to start with. Okay. They don't look like... Where Where were they going to put this guy anyway? There really isn't any way good, is it? Oh. Did I want that tile? No, I wanted this tile. Yes. Because that's the three mountain adjacency. Yes, that was going to be a good campus spot. Um, yep. All seems good to me. I don't think they're going to expand to it, so we shall keep it. You can move over the river, you can move over here. And I guess next turn we attack. Unless I'm wrong. Do we still have... Um, okay. What do we need? Maybe we actually get an encampment over here. Oh, I guess we grab the monument. Yeah. Okay. Hundred percent holy site adjacency bonus. Plus a hundred percent. So that'd get us six science. Unless I'm wrong. That's actually might be really good. If we drop this, grab this, actually, 
We'll keep this. Yes. Now. Wow. Eight and eight. What's my campus making? Five. Wow, that one's good. Okay, well, I guess we start by... Oh, we declare war first. I never betray you. We were, we were never friends. I denounced you ages ago. You just deal with it. Goodbye. I said so nicely. No man is above the law. It behooves you to remember that. Is everyone gonna... I'm sorry, Teddy. He didn't like us anyway. Gandhi is the one I'm really worried about. He still doesn't hate us. And... Discuss. Make a deal. How about I give you, like, just just a, a small gift of, of 20 gold. Um... There we go. He, uh, we are a warmonger, but Gandhi doesn't hate us. And he probably can't. We're only a moderate warmonger. I'm pretty sure he couldn't, actually. Thank you for your settler. That was much appreciated. Um... The city is probably... Because we have to shoot through its defences first. Which is going to be a bit of a problem. Because see, you notice... Oops. Sorry. Yeah, see, you notice how there is, uh... Yeah, yeah, no, no. Just let me shoot you. Did I shoot with this guy? Yeah, no. Can he not shoot? Oh, indeed he can't. Okay, that sucks. Um, if I move him up here, maybe he can. It might have been because he had to shoot over a hill. Um. Oh, wow. He does a lot of damage, but he takes a lot of damage. I'd say we take it. Uh, this guy out here will duke it out. Down here, we'll duke it out against the spearman. The horseman, I mean. Kill the horsey! Uh, it was... Oh, and you can actually get a promotion. Wow, did you take more damage? Oh yeah, the horseman took way less damage. Okay. Uh, well, we will give you your promotion. What is your HP at? Okay, you'll be fine. Unless they decide to shoot you with their city walls, that's actually a possibility. Okay, we may lose that spearman. I didn't think about that. I am a noob. Um, we probably won't get that one, will we? Maintain four trade routes. We'll get this one. Actually, you know what? On second thoughts, we'll grab military training because we're so close. It's just eight turns. And I don't mind if I don't get the Eureka for it. We are not playing on a particularly high difficulty. Do we grab an encampment? I'd say we just build like another spearman, right? But the heavy chariots. Battering ram. Heavy chariot. Movement two, movement two. So oh, we'll get, we'll grab the chariot. It's just slightly, slightly more damage. Um. Uh, what do you still need? A temple. Ultimately, aqueduct. If I built an aqueduct here, yes. Uh, what can we do with our faith? Alright, next turn, let's see how badly we lose the spearman. Alternately, they might not. What guides you? Surely you cannot believe in nothing. Come, show your people the light. We have a religion. <sighs> what would your friends think of this information? They don't like us because we're a warmonger. Yeah. 
Wow. Wow, everyone really dislikes us now. Maybe we will just have to steamroll everyone. Oh, are we going to lose our archer? I didn't even think about that. Oh, of course, we have... Ah, yes, good point, good point. Okay, well, if nothing else, we can... Ah, oh, yes, no one likes us. No one likes us. Waiting for Gandhi to denounce us. Oh. No hour of life is wasted that is spent in the saddle. Oops. That was well, he needed to move out of the way anyway. I think. You have a promotion. Doesn't help right now. So that I can get out of here. Oops. That was a. Oh, gods. This, like. It's selecting units for me is super annoying. Um, there is an option for this, isn't there? Okay, well that sucks. I'll look for that later. Um, I think this guy goes here and then fortifies. Where would we like to trade you? Oh yeah, these guys definitely at war with us now. If I go city states, yep, because Scythia, uh, Scythia is the uh, suzerain. Okay. Well, um, where do we send a thing? Yeah, that's not bad. We'll do that one. Choose the research of... Um... Stirrups. Get knights. Okay, well... This may be a very short-lived war and uh, become defensive really, really quickly. Just, we'll shoot everything with it. Shoot. 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 Yeah. City's defense is just too high. Um... Possibly made a mistake. <laughs> uh, I didn't bring enough uh, enough units, did I? Ah ha ha. Okay, well, Phoenix made a mistake, guys. Oh, speaking of mistakes, Phoenix has gone way over the episode time, hasn't he? All right. Well, after this turn, we are going to be stopping because wow, we are guessing. No way they can kill that guy. No, he was fortified. He, they probably still kill him, but... Oh, wow. Do they... Wait a second. I... S was it these guys who had the horsemen that aren't weak to spearmen? Oh, that would suck. Oh. Oh, that sucks. Um... Wait, 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 who are we moving? 
I think we grab this guy's promotion. I think we focus on... Actually, what does your promotion get you? Exercise, zo uh, exercise zone of control, or... Defense versus city attacks. No. I say we just focus on killing this guy. Okay, well, evidently this was possibly not an optimal, uh... An optimal war to start. But this is part of the learning experience, right? I am learning these things. Okay, uh... We need to start building, like... Oh, we probably needed catapults. Ah. So stupid. So stupid. Ah, why didn't I... Ah, I'm so silly. Um, also this place is gonna need ancient walls. Actually, uh, we should probably build ancient walls around here, shouldn't we? Yeah, just because this place is gonna need to defend itself. Um... Can we purchase a unit to defend this? No. No faith purchases. Okay, well, I'd say we'd start working on the ancient walls. Because I'm pretty sure these guys... Uh, can these guys take it? I don't know. Oh. I should probably turn on, like, quick movement and stuff. Rip battering ram? Yep. Do they actually capture the battering ram? No, it just gets destroyed. Okay, that's interesting to know. Yes, I think now we focus on being uh, defensive. <laughs> Phoenix makes mistakes. Alright, um, well you can move back a tile. Which means they can't just attack you across the river. Uh, we need to focus on one of them. Oh, we'll give it a sec. I might turn on... Uh... Oh wow, these... Horses don't mess around. Wow. Okay, well, um... I'm not worried about this guy. We can just shoot him. And we can protect this farm with this guy. So if he decides to pillage that, we're not in trouble. Uh, who has the promotion? You have the promotion. Now, these horses shouldn't be able to cross the river and attack, so at least this archer should survive. And this one will probably survive as well. Oh, yeah. Okay, well, we just shoot this guy a little bit. That guy can fortify until healed. Um. I'm not 100% sure where we settle this guy. Okay, um. Well, these units all retreat. Because we're probably going to need to defend our cities until, they dis until we uh, kill off all their units. Which will happen inevitably. I'm not too worried about killing these guys. But maybe I did choose the wrong army to attack. You know, the people with the overpowered horses. Don't they produce like two horses each? And yep, we've gone way over. So I... I may actually have to split this up. Who knows? Um... Maybe it'll just be a super long episode, in which case I apologize. Either way, hope you guys have enjoyed, and I shall see you next time.